Hey guys, it's your boy Joe back at it again, man. CodingFace.com live from New York City, man. We out here, man. I mean, I'm actually in the suburbs out here of New York City, but we here, man. Okay, so one thing that you probably noticed by now is a little different in you know the quality, the you know the little feeling of the the whole channel and where I'm going, you know, for this 2018. I'm trying to step my game up, you know. All this stuff have been here. I told you guys I already had cameras, I already had microphones, I already had lenses. You know, matter of fact, this there's a new lens, but um, it, it's definitely worth it. Makes your boy look nice and spiffy. You just hey, you got what I mean. So make your boy feel good. But yeah, I'm trying to step it up this year. I told you guys uh, from here. Once I move back to Queens, I, I'm setting up a studio. Uh, you know, nice lights, uh, a good setup something legit something that we could be proud of and at the same time i want to have like a space where i could come in and bring you guys in you know all of you guys who are in the east coast of the united states you're more than welcome to come to my my offices you're more than welcome to come to my my studio and and you know see for yourself everything that i'm trying to do you know and like i said before man I, i'm trying to stay away from controversy i'm trying to stay away from talking about other people y'all know who are the ty lopez y'all know who are the seo junkies you know who who are the people who are here trying to milk you guys you know milk mountain you know every single type of boot camp that's out there that's trying to get that money from you guys you know me i'm not here for that i'm here i'm just some regular dude i'm just like you guys right you know when people come in and, and leave crazy comments it's for the you know for the simple fact that i'm just some regular dude you know what i mean like i'm not here to try to be professional i'm not speaking professional i'm just being myself i talk to you guys exactly how i talk to my friends i'm not trying to be something that i'm not i'm not trying to lie to you guys i'm not trying to hit you with the bs you know what i mean like that's what I, that's what i'm trying to do for this 2018 just trying to be real with you guys just be honest you know what i mean and just keep on working get your skills up help you guys out to become better developers and you know a lot of people is gonna like the content a lot of people is gonna hate it just because i have a real opinion i don't follow what the blogs tell me i don't follow what uh you know other youtubers tell me i don't follow what the trends are i don't look at google trends and be like Oh, today view is hot, so we all gotta switch to view. No, I don't work in that world. I work in in the world of reality, the world of hey, I'm not looking for clicks. I, hey, I'm not looking for views. It's just this thing comes organically. I don't pay for none of my subscribers. I don't pay for uh, the views. Everything that's here are pretty much for from people that just find me naturally, you know, uh, organically, you know. And I take pride in that. I take pride in the fact that. Everything that I've been doing on this channel has been authentic. Everything that I've said over here has been true. I, I share my opinions. I'm not saying that everything that I say is 100%, but from what I know and from the years that I've been in the industry and from the fact that I've actually been in the industry, and, and you know, some people come in here and give you advice, haven't you know, they haven't been in the industry for more than 10 years. You know, there's people who never even worked a day in their lives in, in, in any major company and are giving advice. You know, it's like that's them, you know what I mean? <laughs> that's not me. I'm just here to do me, and that's it. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm here to just pretty much just share sharing my knowledge like there's a lot of regular people out there you know this johnny the the mechanic this you know cindy the receptionist this you know charlie the girl who's at marketing is like man i'm tired you know preparing this emails how about i just switch it up and become one of the developers you know what i mean like that's my target audience i'm not looking for people who are like man i want to be the the smartest person in the world like yeah you could be the smartest person in the world but if you're broke like who cares you get what i mean like i'm here for the people that's looking to change their lives put some money in their pocket and be able to have a good career something that they could love and have fun with you know like i love coding i code every single day a minimum of six hours minimum like literally like every single day i'm doing something that has to do with code or i'm coding you know a project for myself or a client that i might have or i might just be helping other people out like people send me emails like hey joe how can i solve this problem that i'm having and i just sit down there and help them out that's what i do you get what i'm saying so yeah like this whole 2018 is gonna be real nice 
you know, we just coming in with very good positive vibes. We don't we don't want to deal with nobody. You know, haters. You know, people who come in here question me, commenters, or you know, the trolls. You know, God bless you. You know, if you're mad because a regular dude just came in and got in the game and just ah dunked it from the three point line, then that's on you. You know what I mean? Like, it's not my fault that I'm popular out here. It's not my fault that people like me. It's always been like that my whole life. Everybody likes me. I'm cool with everybody. I'm just that type of person, you know? But at the same time, it's, it's not my fault. It's the swag. It's the sauce. It's, you know, it's like, you get what I'm saying? Like, we here, you know? And it's like, it's cool because it's like, nobody does this like this. There's nobody in this game, especially in web development, who's somebody like me, you know? Like somebody with the swag, the sauce, and it's just, it, it's just nobody's out here like that. You get what I'm saying? So we're doing something different. That's what I wanted to bring into the tape. I wanted to bring in, you know, that New York swag, that New York feeling, you know, the the raw, the realness. You know, it's like <laughs> somebody was telling me, I forgot what this guy's name. Somebody was telling me, it's like, man, you give me, he's like, he's like a. Not saying an uh, old head, but he's like, he's a guy from like the 80s. He's like, man, you remind me of like Dice, Dice the comedian, like just the rawness of like New York. It's like it gives you that feeling. And it's like, you know what? If, I, if I'm that, cool. You know, because sometimes like, you know, there's a lot of BS. There's a lot of uh, people who are very uh, PC. You know, they try to, you know, you can't say anything on the internet no more. Somebody's going to question you. Somebody's going to. Uh, hate on you somebody's gonna be like oh you wrong oh i'm smarter than you oh i do this and that or oh, I, 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 like <laughs> this you know sky's the limit for those people like they just here for that you know me i'm just here to help people out you know i have my website everybody knows that pretty much when i first came in here i didn't have no website i wasn't planning on selling anything i wasn't planning on on creating courses like i wanted to actually become a teacher you know teach web development but at the end of the day after doing the research and all the stuff I'm like man I don't want to go back to school to get a master's to go teach out of college like I'd rather just come in and just create my videos create the content that I want to create share it with the people people that care about it you know people that just enjoy it great you know it's like I wasn't gonna go the, the long road of like man now I gotta go in and freaking go get my master's in computer science to go to a, a college or go to like a high school and teach, you know, freaking programming and web development. Like, I love this. You know what I mean? Like, I'm here because I love this. You know, I'm not doing this because, hey, I'm trying to become a millionaire. If I wanted to become a millionaire, I would be charging $200, $300 per course or some crazy numbers like that. You guys know what I'm talking about. But that's not what I'm here for. You know, I'm just here like, okay, cool. What's like the minimum that we need to, to be comfortable? You know what I'm saying? What's the minimum to be comfortable and be able to give as many people the content? It's really, for me, it, it, it's a thing about how can I get as many people as I can to watch me and watch my content and, and enjoy it. You know what I mean? Like, instead of saying, hey, man, I could literally charge five people a $1,000 and I put them in a webinar, give them all of my courses, and now, hey, I five people per month I'm good people do that you know what I mean they come in they try to sign up 10 people you know that's ten thousand dollars great cool but that's not really what I'm, I'm here for like why would I care about just giving it to 10 people that's dumb like I want everybody to just learn from my mistakes learn from the things that I've done good and, you know everything that I tell you guys is from you know real life experience it's like I'm coming in from somebody who was self-taught you know, I tried everything out there. I went from uh, CoSchool.com, Team Treehouse. I did a uh, uh, Code Academy. I did a uh, Free Code Camp. You know, y'all know how I feel about Free Code Camp. Free Code Camp it was great for practice, but none of these websites were teaching me how to build real websites. Like, you know what I mean? Like, yeah, I could come in and be like, oh, change the background of a div, but how do I put all of this stuff together? You know, if somebody don't come in and tells you how to do it, you know, you don't really learn it, you know. So that's the, the, the beauty of Udemy. For me, when I found Udemy, I was like, man, this is amazing. Yes, there's a lot of BS courses. Yes, because anybody could come in. They don't vet 
they don't vet people. They don't. It's like, hey, yeah, you freaking, <laughs> you from uh, you know Bangladesh and you got a microphone. You could do slides. Great. Here you go. Even though nobody can understand you, or even though nobody, uh, <laughs> you know what I mean? Like nobody understand what this person's saying, or or you know get to follow their course. Like they don't care. They're like they let them through. But then, then you find the uh, you know the people that really care about this. You got the Cole Steels. You got the Stephen Grider. You got uh, myself. You know now I'm part of the game. You know what I mean? Like uh, just the other day, people from Udemy hit me up like, "Yo, you hot out here." Like, just to be honest with you guys, like, they just literally told me, like, yo, you hot out here. Like, straight up. A lot of people are noticing you. And, you know, there's definitely future in there, right? For me, I just, I, I told you guys, I, I have this, this idea. I want to create a, as much content as I can. And I want to create this company, which, you know, I might be giving you guys more details later on. Because right now I'm doing, you know, getting everything incorporated and, you know, just setting everything up. I want this to be like a real business that I could literally pay people off, you know, give them a 1099, or if, you know, if they're part of the company, give them a W-2. Like, I want to have some legit stuff. Like, this isn't, I didn't just come in and be like, hey, man, I'm going to leave this job just to be out here for the hell of it. Like, I'm here because this is a business. You get what I'm saying? Like, and I'm not talking about YouTube, a business. My life is a business. You know, everything that I do in my life from now on, is going to be part of my business you know what I mean so YouTube is just like a 20% of everything else that I'm doing you know so you guys gonna see more of it you know for the next year but I just want to say man I'm so happy that you guys are here with me I'm so happy that you guys are enjoying the videos and you guys are enjoying the content you know we here man all right so it's your boy Joe back at it again codingface.com guys go subscribe to my channel if you're not subscribed Go to my website. Listen, man. Literally, if you click the link below, you get 50% off on everything, man. And, yeah, trust me, man. You could leave a comment. Leave a comment and ask other people and be like, yo, is the course is legit? Is it worth my money? Is it worth my time? The people will tell you. It's not just me that's like, oh, like I'm creating something cool here. It's leave a comment. Ask the people. Ask the people from YouTube. Ask the people from, you know, Quora. Ask the people from, uh, you know, Twitter. Instagram, the whole shebang, like anywhere you want, ask, just ask and be like, hey, is it legit, is it cool, is it something that I can learn something out of it, and you're going to see that people's going to be like, yeah, everybody's enjoying it, and you know, they're learning all the courses and learning the things that they need to learn to become a developer, and not only that, just, there's like, I give you guys like, you know, life experience, like I've been through it all, you know what I mean, like I've already been through a lot. So it's like, I don't want you guys to go through the same mistakes that I already did. So that's all I'm doing here on YouTube. All right. So 2018, here we come. CodingFace.com. It's your boy Joe. Back at it again. CodingFace.com.